Hello and thanks for joining me. Welcome to this episode of MI Bandit Podcast, where we'll be exploring some fascinating things that are shaping the future of our world, from groundbreaking research and in AI, machine learning to bold ideas to sustainably social justice. These things are challenging our assumptions and publishing the boundaries of what's possible. So buckle up, buckle up. That doesn't make sense because you're on a motorbike. What are you going to buckle up for? Chat GPT, well done. Thank you for giving me this intro because we're about to embark on a journey of discovery and innovation. Mm, what we're covering today, let me give you the main gist of it. So motorcycle seat discomfort explained. We're going to look at some motorcycle theft where the owner was injured. We're going to look at how old can you be to ride a motorcycle as well as a quick comparison uh, article about honda rebel kawasaki vulcan and a royal enfield i reckon you're gonna find it interesting and also things about motorcycle seats why are they so discomfortable thank you for trusted creators for making this episode possible let's have a look at the first article and get straight into it motorcycle discomfort what's that all about so the science of motorcycle discomfort explained thank you mcn for this article it looks like they've spent a bit of time you can see the heat graph there of your how one's uh, rear creates a, a pattern on the seat he's sitting on a cbr there so let's have a quick look at what's going on here motorcycling can over long distance quite literally become the pain in the backside well new, now comfort air have discovered why and oh and may have a solution that looks like a cushion it looks like a fancy cushion to me i used to have this fancy cushion i bought back in the day when i had the r6 you know them little like yoga special balls in there like foam pellets i don't know if that that was a thing or not but those that did help it made like a two hour journey com- more comparable to like a, an hour journey but it was still bad okay the results of threshold does it work does it work is my question the same test mm, comfort air cushion might work maybe possibly would you buy it is the question the test found that pressure points increase in heat resulting in perspiration which leads to an accelerated loss of control electrolytes adding to the muscle discomfort okay so certain points being pushed down it depends how you sit as well because some people sit like slightly you know differently and all our shapes are different as well and our weights are different so interesting article there Stuart. thank you for that and the mc and that was the first one so i think that was we need to cover that first because you know discomfort is a discomfort but what we got next today, I've had a quick uh, scour of the old interwebs to see what else is out there. So let's have a look at the next article. It's always interesting having a look at different types of bikes, especially when you're in the, the market for like a, a nice motorcycle. This is a clash on MCN Honda Rebel, Kawasaki Vulcan 650 and Super Meteor by Royal Enfield. Same kind of looking bikes, you know, like that vintage type, nice looking. You want to keep them clean or else they'll get really dirty, really fast. Okay, McDonald's, Coca-Cola, Hershey's bars. Okay, they compared them to like a ni- nice article there. Who wrote this one? We'll have a look at the end. Uh, we do love a US import over here, but by the time it reaches our shores, sometimes a small reduction in size is required to fit our less indulgent tastes. Yeah, because we're not really power hungry. We just like like a nice ride. That is an amazing shot. I like that, like a bit of lean, but you can see, is he touching? It looks like his foot's touching there on the corner. Over the pond, big is the most certainly viewed as better, but in the UK, our more, mm, okay. Can I have a quick overview? John Erie, continue reading. You can read the full article. I will, I will say, go and have a look at that full article. You know what, I'm, I'm going to get the link. I'm going to put the link in the description. Have a look at that because I don't want to spoil the fun for you. I reckon sometimes it's good to read. I'm going to put that in the, the show notes. So check that out and you'll see this article. I'll quickly get my notepad up here for you. So you've got that accessible. That is the review on those bikes. So I head over to MC and have a have a quick read on that. A, a really nice. Who's, have they got a new photographer? I really like how they've done their photos. Looks like they've got a dedicated person taking photo shots now. So good job there, John Uri, MCN. So I want to, can I quickly have a sneak peek though? Can I have a quick... Yeah. Let's have a quick uh, sneak peek what, what came out on top because I'm interested now. That's like a nice uh, nice selection of bikes and which one would be... Okay, you need to remember, content is only available to MCN members. How much is this? So yeah, join as a member, mate, and you can you can check the article out. Thank you very much, MCN. Okay, so 
what does that mean for us what is the best place to hide your motorcycle if your motorcycle has been taken where do you think they're keeping your mo- motorbike scooter motorcycle you know why they're keeping it they're keeping it in their bathroom mate so no one can find it if you've got a tracker they're gonna just put it in the bath fill it up with water i'm joking okay so the daily mirror i'm not a big fan of the mirror but they've got an article here that gave me a bit of a, a kick, kick please shocked to find stolen motorcycle parked inside a bathroom in someone's house firstly that's not a motorcycle it's a scooter uh, so mirror you're already giving us infactual information which is why i don't like the mirror okay comical pictures show the stolen vehicle blocking off access to the toilet shower and basin with little room for the homeowner to maneuver in the property on tower street dudley holy moly looks like a nice bike though is it a forza i was like a yamaha f- no honda forza am i right am i wrong oh, they won't know will they because they're calling it a motorcycle but yeah what ha- what do you think happens to your bike once it's stolen they're giving you a shower mate that's what they're doing giving you an absolute shower shower uh motorcycle shower like baby shower kind of idea mm, there's a few more of these because i've seen that theft is seems to be a mm, you know it seems to be a issue at the moment so what do you reckon we'll have a, a look at most of these is there another one here that we can consider i think there is when it comes to motorcycle theft you know what are you safe there seems to be quite a few articles at the moment today checking out the news thieves caught on camera stealing motorcycle in westbury police have appealed for witnesses after a motorcycle was stolen from a street in westbury in early hours this morning so where was it parked oh it's parked in a street okay so it's, yeah it's tough if you don't have somewhere to park it or lock it up that like chain it somewhere the red and white colored bike was taken at 12 44 oh, come on mate john barker you could give it the name what, what bike is this oh, i can't see well enough red and white so what do you think uh, leave me in the comments do you know what bike that is I'm, I'm sure there's gonna be a pro out there if you're watching the video version of this you should be able to see my picture on screen the red and white motorcycle was taken watch the video at the post below so there is a cctv footage for this can i find it it seems to be that everywhere you look that people are just trying to take bikes now so it's, it's come to that point now i think when you hear it about in the news that's when you know what's going down at the moment we've got a man 81 was injured when he was robbed of his motorcycle in keely a teenager has been spared an immediate custodial distance sentence after an 81 year old man was injured when he was robbed of his motorcycle okay the owner heard a noise and saw the bike being taken he confronted the thieves and was then kicked and injured ah my that's a tough one these days they don't care do they uh, he's been remanded in custody and since september equivalent to serving a 14 month custodial sentence oh my days mate oh my days halima sahid telegraph and argus thank you for this community reporter i've got another one for you you know what we need to improve our skills it's coming back to that time again now everybody's getting back on the roads if it's been a year since your last road if you're like a good seasoned rider you want to be careful how well your skills are because when you get back on the road take it easy go easy sergeant rob gillingham from the central motorway policing group cpmg pg apo is uh, leading workshops in this area for biker down a project created in memory of pc luke van d sande who lost his life in the off-duty motorcycle crash back in 2019 okay so they're creating awareness ah look at that it's never good to see that is it oh dear mate i, I don't like reporting on this kind of stuff but improve your skills make sure that you're not taking it for granted be safe and take it easy please yes bam 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 improve your skills that is the that is where it's at mate that is where it at. that is where it's at what else we got i got a nice light-hearted one shall we end with a light-hearted one i think we should end on a light-hearted one which is over here let's go and call this a quick article update today for you and guess what it is <laughs> 